Hey guys, so today I'm going to talk about comic book artists that I like that are, to me, gothic or gothically inclined. As you know, I love reading comics and it's kind of my escape. I love it. I love comics and horror movies and I like them. The more macabre, the better for me. So two comic artists I'm going to talk about today are some of my favorite artists of all time, Roman Dirge and also Jonan Vasquez. So Jonan Vasquez, back in the day, um, had a really awesome comic series called Johnny the Homicidal Maniac, and if you are a Johnny the Homicidal Maniac fan, or Squee fan, also he did Invader Zim, which is a really well-known cartoon, you guys might like some of his stuff, some more of his stuff. So here is what I have. I'm just going to show off, some, this is just a small amount of my collection. Got Squee. I love Squee. Here's Johnny. You guys like Johnny, you know who Na Happy Noodle Boy is. There's some more stuff. You might see me with a shirt that has this graphic on it. That's what this is in reference to. If you like kind of twisted, macabre things, you would definitely like a lot of his art. Later on, he went to do the series, let's see, Invader Zim. He does, I have Invader Zim comics in here somewhere. There's like, this is the graphic novel of Johnny the Homicidal Maniac. Got some filler bunny. And let me see. Got a lot of comics in here. And here's an invader. Here's one of the Invader Zim comics that I have. It's pretty awesome. So yeah. That is Joan Vasquez. He had a lot of stuff that was published, I believe, by I think it was Slave Labor Graphics. I love Slave Labor Graphics. And I'll list their shop down below. I dated a comic artist named Eddie. And we were both like really obsessed with Jonan Vasquez and a lot of his work. And we love him. And let's see, um, this is Invader Zim. And this is like the box that all the DVDs come in. It's really cool because it's like a little house when you open it. Here, let me open it and show you guys. And they have all the Invader Zim DVDs in there. If you guys haven't checked out Invader Zim and you kind of like weird, kooky cartoons, you guys should check that series out. It's been out, you know, for years and years and eons. So I'm kind of one of those people, like, when I find a comic artist that I like, I stick with them. I'm pretty loyal. It's like a little... I still haven't opened it after all these times. This is from, like, I think that someone got this at Tower Records. This is from back in the day, dude. Like, um, like I tend to hold on to things that I like for a really long time. Like this is from the 90s. I was 16 when I got this. And I was 16 when I discovered all of my favorite comic artists. There's a lot more that I like. So if you guys like these videos and you want me to do more comic book artist videos, I'm pretty enthusiastic about them. If you want to talk more about that, I will do some more videos. And please list down below some of your favorite comic artists that you like. Here is Roman Dirge is also an amazing artist that I love. He's very macabre and interesting, and Lenora is one of his comics. He's so awesome. And I recently just got this one. This is Wedgies. And here's this other one. He has a bunch of little Lenore novels, but as you can see, it's pretty cool. If you guys haven't heard of Roman Dirge, you should check him out. It's pretty awesome. I like this because it came with a lot of these little these little placards. I just got this at a comic shop downtown, but I've had the red book for a really long time. So that's kind of what some of his art looks like. So yeah, if you guys want more of these videos, if you like it, awesome. If you thumbs up, if you like it, thumbs down. If you don't, and if you don't, tell me what authors that you like. Cause I, you know, everyone has a difference of opinion. We don't all have to agree, but I'd like to know who you like, who you don't like. Um, and or if you do like, like kind of macabre comic artists, definitely tell me, you know, like where to find out their stuff because I'd like to find more artists. I probably already know about them, but if I don't, and there's like a little gem out there that I don't know about, please let me know. All right, cool. I'd like to do another comic artist thing talking about James O'Barr because I really love The Crow. So hopefully sometime I will do that. Thank you so much. Please subscribe for more fun videos. Okay, bye.